But at the fall of the Western Empire, the organ disappeared from uh, disappeared from the West, not to uh, not to reappear until um, I think it was 757 or thereabouts. That's when, a pretty big chunk of history. Pepin le Bref, the father of Charlemagne, having crowned himself king of the Franks, uh, received a an embassy from the Byzantine emperor, and among the gifts in this embassy was an hydros. And it, was it built in, or was it a separate thing? Or? Well, it, I mean, the, it wasn't, the hydraulics wasn't huge. I okay. He carried this thing in a cart. Oh, and okay. the emperor sent him one, and it, it just knocked the socks off everybody, and, and next thing you know, people start they, they picking the up the science. Yeah. And Well, thank you, sir. Okay. Thank you for the history lesson. This is excellent. There we go. All right. Well, that's it for today. You guys have fun. That's today's Adventure with Duck, where we learned about pipe organs with James Louder. So you guys have fun. You can find more information at www.thegeekgroup. And uh, send us your questions and comments. Comment on the video here, rate it. And uh, if you have any other questions that aren't answered here, give us uh, an email at info at thegeekgroup.org. And we're happy to help you out with anything we can. You guys have fun. I'm Chris Bowden, and that's today's Adventure with Doug. See you.